Hey guys, this is Austin, and these are 5 smartphone life hacks. Basically, every phone out there comes with a charger, but they're not all created equal. A generic 1 amp power brick can take hours and hours to recharge your phone, which can feel like forever when you've only got a few minutes to plug it in. Most new Android phones though support quick charging, which can cut this time down massively. It comes in a few different flavors, but the most common is a 2.1 amp output. This also goes for the iPhone. Newer models will charge way faster when you swap the stock adapter with an iPad charger. Speaking of the battery, there's a lot you can do to keep from hitting the outlet before the end of the day. Most phones have a low power mode which can be helpful when you get low on battery, but something you should absolutely do is dive into settings and check what's draining your phone. If you see an app killing your charge, you can try disabling the location or background app refresh and see how that helps. While we're in settings, we can also speed up your phone. While animations make things look nice, they can actually slow your phone down. It might seem minor to wait an extra second, but considering just how many times you open apps and unlock your phone every day, it absolutely adds up. In Android, you can change this by rapidly tapping the build number in About Phone to unlock developer settings, and then change the animation speed to something a little faster. On iOS, jump into the Accessibility menu and turn on the Reduce Motion option. There are also a lot of ways of stepping up your photo game. Basic things like enabling the 3x3 grid help a ton for properly composing your shots, and lots of smartphones have pro modes that allow you to fully tweak the settings on your camera to get the shot just right. One little tip on the iPhone is to tap and hold where you want to focus. This will lock both focus and exposure, and you can change it by dragging up and down, giving you a way of locking down the shot. The best way to lock things down though is with a physical tripod. You can buy an adapter to mount your phone, and with clip-on lenses, you can totally change the look of your photos and videos to transform your smartphone into a serious tool. Screenshots have been around forever, but sometimes you just need to record video from your screen. Most phones have an HDMI adapter you can use to get video out to a TV, which you can record with something like the awesome Elgato Game Capture HD, but there's a simpler way of doing it. Phones like the Galaxy S7 have a built-in recorder that works surprisingly well for gameplay, but an option like AZ Screen Recorder works well on basically any Android device. If you have a Mac, the iPhone also has a neat way of doing this. Plug it in via Lightning, and inside QuickTime, you should see the iPhone listed as a camera under New Movie Recording. This should mirror your screen on the Mac and let you easily record whatever you like. So what are some life hacks you guys have found useful? Let me know in the comments below, and if you enjoyed, be sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this.